Hello everyone. If numbers never lie, then Abdelatif Baka is truly the fastest 1,500 meter runner at the 2016 Olympics. Baka, a partially blind runner from Algeria, ran a 3 minutes 48 seconds and 29 milliseconds at the Rio Paralympic Games on Monday, not only set a world record in his Paralympic division but also besting the gold medal winning run of 3 minutes 50 seconds and 0 milliseconds by American Olympic gold medalist Matthew Centrowitz. Even more amazing. Three more of Baca's competitors at the T13 division of the Paralympic Games ran faster than Centrowitz's gold medal winning time. Tamiru Demis of Ethiopia ran 3 minutes 48 seconds and 49 milliseconds for the silver medal, while Henry Kirwa of Kenya won bronze with 49.59. Baca's brother, Foed, also edged Centrowitz's time with a 3 minutes 49 seconds and 84 milliseconds, good enough for fourth. The Baca brothers, Demis, and Kirwa compete in what the Paralympics officially call the T13 division of track and field meaning they are somewhat sighted but still considered visually impaired. With a visual ability ranging from 2 60ths to 6 60ths, competitors can make out shapes while wearing special glasses, but that's about it. Track and field athletes with more severe visual impairment are classified as either T12 or T11. Athletes in T11 are blindfolded and run with guides. Abdelatif Baka broke the existing T13 record 3 minutes 56 seconds and 3 milliseconds run by New Zealand's Tim Prendergast at the Athens Paralympics in 2004. It wasn't easy to get this gold medal, he told the UK's Independent. I've been working one or two years non-stop and it's been very, very hard for me. To be fair, the gold medal race at the Rio Olympics was comparatively slow. Centrowitz ran a kg tactical race en route to the first 1,500 meters gold for the United States in nearly a century, but his 3 minutes 50 seconds and 0 milliseconds was a full 12 seconds slower than USA track and fields, a standard of 3 minutes 38 seconds and 0 milliseconds, nearly 16 seconds slower than the 3 minutes 34 seconds and 9 milliseconds he ran at the U.S. Olympic trials. Several of the time trial races, when athletes had to secure faster times to qualify for their national team's Olympic standards, produced faster times than the Olympic final. So even though Centrowitz won gold with a 350, he and the other finalists could clearly have run much faster. Even so, race is the race, and the times are the times. We'll put it this way. When the medals were on the line, Baca's record-breaking run was the fastest 1,500 run in Rio this year. Thanks for watching. For more videos like this press the like and subscribe button.